Do I see what I'm building, Lumpa? Hey. Robot. Cool. It just said robot. Robot. A robot. Robot. Good robot. morning. Not showered or dressed yet. It is 11.30. Dogs woke us up at 7. After I tossed and turned until about quarter to 3. So I'm in a majorly crabby mood right now. Um, my back was horrible yesterday. It was one of the most painful days I've ever had. And I was really looking forward to a good long night's sleep to kind of let it relax and maybe start to get better. But no. Right now I'd give you money to take my dogs. Anyway, the thing is, Pharaoh likes to eat, as you all know, and so he gets up in the morning, decides he's hungry no matter what time it is, comes to our bedroom door and starts pawing at it, whining and barking. Well, so that it wouldn't wake me up, Pete has gotten into the habit of getting up and feeding him. So Pharaoh has learned that it works, and I'm not faulting Pete, don't get me wrong, I'm not criticizing him, he didn't want the dog to wake me up. I made some bacon. I cut up all the leftover chicken from two different chicken dinners and mixed it all together with mayonnaise, onion, some of the bacon, cheese, uh, parsley, salt, a little more salt. And that's to go in the wraps that I made yesterday, the flatbreads for lunch, which will be later because right now we're about to eat breakfast. I'm just going to make some eggs scrambled with sour cream and cheese and then of course we have the rest of the bacon so that'll be our what we eat now we have tons of leftovers so after this we'll just be eating leftovers the rest of the day and maybe tomorrow too i don't know but that's good because i won't have to cook and i can today when leland has his rest time at two o'clock hugma gets her rest time because <laughs> this is crazy this is just crazy I can't even stand to be in my own skin when I haven't had enough sleep, especially when it's added together with pain and barking dogs. So, scramble us up some eggs and sour cream and cheese and have it with some bacon. And I will see you guys later. Bye. Six. Of mom, both have six. I have seven. But I don't. So it's almost 1.30. <laughs> at 2 o'clock, what happens at 2 o'clock? We both get to go to sleep. But do I see my cards? Why would you show me your cards? I'm just kidding. Oh. <laughs> Here's I my cards. Leland's helping me stay awake by playing Uno with me. This is what, the 38th game? Yeah, he needs sleep too. See the dark circles? Of, and a little bit of Spanish. <laughs> yeah. Don't get him oh started! God. Chase, go get him started! Yeah, the other one, yes, they don't know whether. Yes, they don't say there is a zigzag job. They think go bing bong! I have no idea what all that was, but I will tell you this. Do it! You do it, Ogma! Okay. Okay, guys, it's 7 o'clock. This afternoon at 2 o'clock, Leland had his rest period or his rest time. I took my rest time and got up at 6. Pete had already fed Leland and taken care of the birds and the dogs. Leland has been making lots of nice drawings and for us. We, have, we each have a nice big stack of drawings next to us here. And that's my day. Totally uneventful. Totally boring. We've just been having kind of a quiet day. I admit that it got off to a bad start, so. But uh, tomorrow's another day. Little Pete's tucking Leland in right now, and uh, it's about 10 o'clock, so I'm going to get this on my computer and edit it and upload it. Um, we spent the night tonight watching The Prince of Egypt on Netflix. This week, Leland and I have been learning about Moses, and we've been reading about Moses from the book of Exodus. 
Um, and he's learning the Ten Commandments. He's up to number seven, which he's stumbling over because he doesn't understand all the words, but he's done great with the first six. So um, tonight was movie night with popcorn. So when I get up in the morning, he says, do you want to hear the commandments? Or can we work on Bible verses? He just has such an open heart for the Lord. And he is so spiritually sensitive. He is just a joy. He's like any other boy, but he really has a heart that's open to God. So he's doing really good this week. And um, I, myself, I'm, you know, me, I'm a mess. I'm a basket case, as always, watching the Prince of Egypt and where the, you know, where um, Moses, God parts the waters so Moses can lead the people through. And, man, I'm crying, you know. A basket case just seeing the power of my father and knowing I belong to him I just can't I can sit here and cry <laughs> so anyway um magnificent magnificent what a mighty God we serve right all right guys time for me to get this on my computer and edit it and send it up um and then we'll see what tomorrow brings I'd like to do something kind of fun tomorrow, but I don't know quite what. I guess Saturday we will probably go to Tip Up Town, and Sunday Casey's coming up to get Leland, and we'll have dinner together and stuff. So that'll be fun. I will look forward to this weekend, too. All right, guys, I will see you tomorrow. Take care, God bless, and good night.